ultimately our goal for these tools in breast imaging is for these tools to look at our mammograms and assess not only if there's cancer present, but identify patterns that are more commonly going to be cancer in the future. This patient has dense breast tissue. You can see this patient's cancer is more difficult to find. So as we go through these images, we're comparing to prior mammograms. And I also have 3D technology that helps me find abnormalities in the breast. We can then pull up our Volpera density scorecard as well as our Transpara report. This is a case where it did a really great job and accurately identify this you know, very subtle cancer that was hiding amongst all of that dense breast tissue. The software itself can provide imaging information about areas necessary for improvement. We make sure our technologists are given wonderful feedback that they're continuing to perform high quality images so that our radiologists can actually find the cancers. All of our images are actually scored through the AI system. So every single image that's taken um, is given a score of perfect, good, moderate, or inadequate. And so from that, we can identify trends. Are we missing parts of the breast? Did we get far back in the breast? As mammographers, that's what we're trained to look for. It's like a personal coach for each tech. The AI is not going to replace physicians, but physicians certainly are gonna have to get comfortable with using AI to perform their job better.